hello you're welcome how to solve this nice math problem solution from what we have here apply the law of indices from when we have root a which can be written as a raised to power half then here let's write this square root here and we have x equals to x raised to power half then raised to power root x here then when we apply the law of indices again from a raised to power m raised to power n is same thing as a raised to power m n that is this power multiplies and we have x equals to x raised to power half times root x that's same thing as root x over 2 here then next step let's take the log on both sides then here we have log x equals to log x raised to power root x over 2 then when we apply the power law of logarithm from log m raised to power p which is same thing as p log m here the power here is root x over 2 then we have log x equals to root x over 2 log x then let's take root x over 2 log x to the left hand side then we have this becomes log x minus root x over 2 log x then equals to 0 from here that is from here we have log x common we factor it out and we have log x into bracket here we have one then minus root x over two here close bracket equals to zero from here and here this multiplies and give us zero so we have two cases we have log x equals to zero from here or we have one minus root x over two equals to zero from here then since log one is equals to zero then it implies here that x is equals to one so we have x equals to one here then on this side we can take minus root x over two to that side we have one equals to root x over two here then when we cross multiply 1 times 2 that is 2 then equals to root x times 1 that is root x then from here taking the square on both sides we have root x squared equals to 2 squared here yeah, square cancel square root and hence here we have x equals to 2 squared to times 2 which is 4 so we have x equals to 4 as well now we can check to verify if this solution satisfies the given problem from what we have which is x equals to root x raised to power root x then when x equals to 1 here yeah, this become 1 equals to root 1 raised to power root 1 is this equal to each other then this is 1 equals to root 1 is 1 also root 1 is 1 1 raised to power 1 is still 1 so we have 1 equals to 1 so left hand side is equals to the right hand side and then x equals to 1 satisfies the given problem then also when x equals to 4 here the equation becomes 4 is equals to root 4 raised to power root 4 
that is here 4 is equals to root 4 that's 2 also root 4 here 2 and 2 raised to power 2 that's 4 so 4 equals to 4 on this side hence from here as well s equals to 4 satisfies this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos and also turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and see you in our next class bye for now